At the beginning of time, God set in motion His vision for humanity. As He began to create heaven and earth, He said, Let there be light. It was a brilliant light that flooded the infant world and gave man the clarity of vision to know truth without having to search for it. And God saw that the light was good and wanted to preserve it for a deserving humanity. He left it hidden in our world and made it man's mission to find it once more. He concealed the light, covered it in darkness, where it awaits us to this day. He shone a light in the darkness. That light is our birthright. The quest to discover it and set the world ablaze with its radiance is our destiny. The ability to do so is our heritage. Within each one of us flickers a soul, the flame of God. We tend to it and keep it bright with the study of Torah and the joys of Jewish life. For ner mitzvah v'torah or, the mitzvahs are a candle and the Torah is light. And when the flame within us burns bright, others can come to warm their souls by its light. And when their torch bursts into life, they share it with others, who then share it with others yet. This has always been the Jewish story, to be Neros Lahoyer, kindling our own flame, and then lighting the flame in others so that they can do the same. From 1950, this call began to grow louder than ever, and more people than ever began to respond. The Rebbe made it the duty of our entire generation. The search for Jewelry's unlit candles entered a new dimension with a scope unprecedented in Jewish history. Hundreds upon hundreds of shlochim streamed out across states, countries, and continents, charged with the mission to uncover the light that lay in the farthest corners of the globe. The fire spread fast, and across the world from Sydney to Stockholm, from the synagogue to the street, more and more torches shook off the darkness and added their radiance. But then, on Gimel Thomas, 19 years ago, we encountered our own world of darkness, a very real and personal darkness. It seemed that our own light would begin to dim, that the call would grow fainter and fainter. as in jeder Mensch nur befragt bei jedem Anossi bei Israel, in den Nishoma Nitzchis, in den Inien Hanisius, das ist ein Fuftern in der Welt, und beloschen hat Gemorre, mal abzukann, eime du mich amisch, ist aufla hallen, eime du mich amisch, Anossi bei Israel, a viele Norde ist Talkos, so wie na wie bald da sein schlichus in Welt i gewen af onfin un durchfin un elfen jeden durchfin sein schlichus in Welt a sie soll massim sein zu sein na dir 
und nach Gang von den Ebersten, ich schade nicht schon, mir geht der Russle Meile, in Nieder Ingen, wo sie ist, als sie gefindet sich Le Meile, und sie ist weggegangen von Le Mato, nur Adrabe, wie der alte Rebbe, bringt die seine Gere Sakedisch von Seher. Als Tadiker de Istale, die Stacker, Bechulo Almin, Jater mit Bechayehi, aber Istalkes von Azadik und Befrat von Anossi, wie Amech Kulam Sadikim, gefindet er sich noch mehr, wie er in dem Ort, wo er gewähnt früher der Nossi, noch mehr, wie sie gewähnt Bechayehi, nicht immer begruft, wie bald das sie fallen, fallen dem und ob die Begrenzungen, wo die Gufe auf dem Begrenzen ist. In our darkness, we found a new energy and resolve. Our lights continued to burn brighter, and today we still hear the call, louder and more insistent than ever. Thousands of Shluchim continue to find more Neshemos and spread the light at an ever-quickening pace. Every single day, countless Jewish souls are lit up with warmth, a helping hand, a shoulder to lean on, a reassuring word, a kind smile. Not a day goes past without the launch of a new Torah class, the start of a new youth group, the opening of another mikvah. Somehow, in the darkness, the light grows on a scale never seen or imagined before. Tonight we convene those who reveal that light. Light in the midst of our own homes. Light in the hearts of our fellow Jews. Tomorrow we return to our communities and bring that flame with us. The light that never ceased shining in the darkness will grow so bright that the darkness will be no more. At this critical time in our history, it is essential that everyone join in this effort to kindle the soul of another Jew. This is now our collective mission. Together, we will reach every single Jew. <laughs> in der ganzen Welt all unheimlich von sich allein und von der Zwiebel herum sich.